Y'all are rude. I wanted to go in there and look around. I wanted to go explore. I wanted to see what was going down. But instead, I get transported back out here. Instead, I have to whoop some losers. Hey, I'm not even going to check to see if my Pokemon are here. I'm just going to go heal my Pokemon. Whenever you need them to heal you, they don't heal you. Then you'll just be... Like, I'll leave the Pokemon Center right now. And I'll be walking towards the lab. And all of a sudden, the NPC will just pop out and be like, Oh, hey there, bud. Look kind of tired. Let me heal your Pokemon up for you. Before I even know what happened. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we turn a uh, text off in the game? <laughs> no one says anything. I click A, and that's it. Do -do 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 -do. I don't know why I'm so impatient. I need to chill out. I don't like we walk on wood. This is tile. Hmm. Professor Sonia, we have a visitor. Hey, Nappy, glad you're here. Who it is? She's my assistant. I've been so busy with research lately that I've had to bring on some extra help. I've been keeping all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose have been gathering here in the lab. Things have been a little hectic around here, but my assistant has been handling things in a proper fashion. She's really been helping me keep things afloat. I really haven't been doing all that much. You're Nappy, the champion, right? I'm really glad I get to meet you. It's an honor, truly. Come here for a moment, would you? There's something I want to I want you to have a look at. Hey. You remember my power spot detector, right? It detects places where dynamaxing is possible. Basically where there's a high concentration of Galar particles. The readings spike. Oh, one hell of a smart board. And that's how I figured it out. Whoa, what's on the maps? It's all the map of the same thing. <laughs> The power spot detector reacted when those two got close. Could it be? Exactly! Follow the readings from the power spot detector and you might be able to find those sword and shield weirdos. Swordward and Shieldwork might claim to be royalty with their weird fancy names, but it's easier to just call them weirdos, don't you think? Let's get back on topic though. I placed power spot detectors all around Galar, and now it's their time to shine. Power spot detectors, action! What? Oh, this one I'm looking for? Why can't I fly there yet? I'm the champion. Whoa, whoa! That's a way bigger reaction than I would have thought. Looks like it's coming from Turffield Stadium. You could always Dynamax Pokemon at the stadium, so that's not exactly unusual. But these readings are way higher than normal. It can't be Eternatus. You already caught it. Maybe it's something related to those sword and shield weirdos. You should go and check it out, Nappy, since you're our snazzy new champion and all. I've set up your town map to show where the strong particle reactions are coming from. So, have a look at it. So, if it's from a stadium, it's just someone having a gym battle. And I needn't stress. Yeah, right. If only it was that easy. Kiss me. Oh, we have to go to Turfield Stadium. Ah. So is it because I'm inside? Hey, go there. <laughs> That's what the option says. Go there. Excuse me. Ah. Excuse me. I want to go to there. Mm. All right. Whoop, whoop. 
reports say we got a really strong galar particle activity coming from this very location. Ooh. Mm -hmm. You're... <laughs> Hello there, champion. So you came. What's going on here? Ah, uh, how carefree can you be? You're the new champion. You're bigger than a Dynamax Pokemon right now. I was actually in the middle of an exhibition match with Pierce. Then this Dynamax Pokemon came charging in. The audience and staff already took shelter. How did it come barging in? Oh! I got everyone who was seated on the north side of the stadium evacuated. You must have heard, right? More Dynamax Pokemon are running amok. Much obliged, Hop. I expect nothing less from a gym challenger. I know we could count on you. I lost in the semifinals, though. Ah! Nappy! Yeah, what the fuck is Hop doing here? I chased those red and blue guys and saw them head into Turfield Stadium. Spoke too soon. Then I heard that uproar and there was no way I could leave it alone. I had to help out. So, uh, sorry, I actually lost sight of them in all the rush. Hmm, those suspicious characters you saw are concerning. But for now, I think we should get this Dynamax Pokemon to settle down first. I'll be glad for your help against such a tough looking opponent, Champion Nappy. Of course. Of course. All right, then let's head to the pitch. I'll lend a hand too. I don't blame the Pokemon, of course, but I'm just a bit miffed they have staged me. You come too, bro of the old champion. <laughs> I don't know how much I can really help. So don't come, Hop. Don't bother. If I come along, I might just end up slowing the rest of you down. I don't really know the guy, but I don't think Leon be all lost about this. Though he does actually get lost a lot. You coming? Uh, okay. He looks like the dude from The Strain. <laughs> Piers might look scary, but he's great at looking after others. He's a big brother after all. Alright, we should get going too. Teamwork. It's gonna be like one of those Dynamax raid battles. With the gym leaders. <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, what is the significance of Serena? Is it because it's royalty and has a crown on its head? And that you go, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, I might not have to do anything. Fuck it up. <laughs> Whoa, Max Mindstorm. Hey, she ain't fucking me up. Who's got the flapper? Milo has a flapple? Wow! I thought that was my flapple, and I was like, I said I don't know goddamn flapple. Milo, can you step back, dog? Like, nobody else is up there. It's just you, bro. <laughs> can you come back here, dog? Alright, wait, you guys. Don't. Oh, I'm dead at maxing. Oh, no, I'm not. Hop it. Fuck you, hop. I don't think I clicked Dynamax, anyways. I think I just heat crashed. What are you doing? Great work, guys. Great work. We did it. 
We did it. Great work, you guys. Teamwork makes the dream work. Get out of my face. Shinari. Shinari Nari. Whew, looks like things finally calmed down a bit. This Dynamax stuff, no matter how many times I see it, I still don't like it. I can see your dislike of Dynamaxing still hasn't changed, Piers. But there was definitely something off about that Dynamax transformation. There wasn't any trainer anywhere, and the Pokemon seemed like it couldn't even control the power itself. Quite right. Normally a Pokemon needs to respond to a Dynamax ban in order to Dynamax, but... It seems there was some discord in the harmony between Trainer and Pokemon. Did you feel anything unusual, Nathy? I don't know. I'm playing a video game, dog. I feel fine. <laughs> hmm, well, I suppose it's a bit early to start drawing any conclusions. There's no Trainer to be found. This really is a mystery wrapped in an enigma. <laughs> wrapped in bacon! <laughs> I'll make sure Turffield Gym takes good care of this Pokemon for the time being. You lot really helped me out there. Thanks for that. Oh, and Nappy, if you should ever need my help, feel free to call me anytime. Rare lead card. Oh. Alright then, follow me, little Serena. Shinari. Pokemon don't even follow its own rules. Oh! <gasps> Well, well, well! Looks like that Dynamax nonsense has calmed down. Well, 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 the champion, as expected. These niggas are in the merch booth! <laughs> ah, it's you too! I knew you'd be here! Give the rusted shield back! Well, I never... It's not like it's something that belongs to you either. Even if it were yours, we wouldn't give it back. Ah! What's with these two? Get over here so I can battle you! Who are these guys? Spectators and staff should have been evacuated. The normal rules simply just don't apply to us. Yes, that's what it means to be celebrities! What? <laughs> Who is this ruffian to question us? You're just someone with strange taste in hairstyles. His entire st Style is complete black and white nonsense, isn't it, older brother? You think I put any faith in words from rude little punks like you? But it seems our experiment was a success, younger brother. Quite, quite. Next time, I'll just try to Dynamax an even stronger Pokemon. Yes, yes, at last we shall reveal the true nature of Zacian and Zamazenta. Whoa, can they Dynamax? I didn't even think about that. What was that about Zakin and Zamazenta? You despicable champion! We're going to keep the young Dynamax Pokemon run wild. And if you want to stop us, do your best to chase after our splendid looking bottoms. More like celebrity bottoms. And with that, farewell. So you're the ones who caused all this. Stop! Hop, they're gone, bro. They're gone. They, they're gone, bro. Calm down, Hop. Oh, calm down, Hop. You don't gotta act so hard. Uh, but they're getting away! Yeah, and they could be leading us to a trap. It's a bad idea to run in unprepared. But still... Uh, fine. You're right, I get it. Good. Let's all calm down for a sec. Thanks to them running their mouths, we know their goal is to force Pokemon to Dynamax. And that they plan to continue doing it. I won't allow it. As the strongest trainer in this room, I won't allow it. There is no time to be hung up on getting back the rusted shield. Nappy, Piers, we gotta stop those two. Are we like a like a Final Fantasy party now? Oh, I'm supposed to use my Open this door, dog. That's where they went. So I'm supposed to look at the map and find the little power spot. Oh, well. Ah, there you are, Nappy. Things are a right proper mess. Just when I thought the Galar particle count turned around Turfield had calmed down, I started getting huge Galar particle readings from Holbury Stadium and Motostoke Stadium. So what exactly happened at Turfield Stadium? Let me explain what happened. What? 
A Dynamax Pokemon went on a rampage. Huh, those Sword and Shield weirdos did it. Oh, Sonya! Hmm, Hop and Piers? Piers, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be back in Spikema? I'm an ex-gym leader. I can be wherever I want. It's not that weird. More importantly, you said there were Dynamax Pokemon in other stadiums. Yes, I'm getting the same readings in other towns as I was from Turfield Stadium. I'm worried about Marnie. Ah, but Spike Month Gym should be okay, right? I'm only seeing readings from Holberry Stadium and Motostoke Stadium. Ah, I see. If Pokemon are being forced to Dynamax and running wild, there's no way I can simply sit. Buy and watch. <laughs> what do you say, Nappy? Uh, I want to chase after those two weirdos. Is it the same thing? Let's head to the stadium. Huh, that's the spirit champion. Leave those sword and shield weirdos to me. I can poke around the net for sightings of them. We'll leave the research into this, uh, Sonya, was it? We should get to the other stadiums and help out. So, wait, time out. I thought that, okay, so just because something's going on at the stadium doesn't mean that they're there. You should never make assumptions. Assumptions only make ass out of you and me. <clears throat> Take me there, I wanna go there. You make it snappy on the double. I got shit to do. I actually have to take Ivy to a bed appointment after this, and it's gonna be her first time. And then I give her her little shots and get her all nice and good to go. So I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Don't get too close to your lot. Things are pretty dangerous here. I don't remember what voice I gave her. <laughs> uh, we know the situation. Are the staff inspectors all right? Yes, they took shelter just a while ago. You know, the more I look at you three, the more I see how old a little group you are. Ugh, leave us alone. We came here to help you out. And I'm grateful for it. That Dynamax Pokemon's power is so intense, I'm sure it gives me trouble. I'd feel a lot more confident about it if you all joined the battle. Let's do it! So is it gonna be a water one? Because that was a grass one there. So we're gonna have a big ass water. Hey, pull up, Lapras! Oh! You know I was gonna make the joke? In Turfield Stadium? Oh, see, this is why I should just say everything that comes to mind. Just no filter. I was gonna say, um, when they said there was a Dynamax Pokemon rampaging, I was gonna say it better be a Gyarados, because that's what they said about Gyarados in like, Rage. And then, boom, we pull up here and they got a. Motherfucking rampaging. Hey, bro. I'm not doing this shit with you, bro. You intimidate me. I'm getting up out of here. How does he outspeed everyone? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, hey, yeah, boy. Pulled up and blew him away. Damn, that Gyarados had a vendetta. What did you do? <laughs> Nessa, what did you do? What did that Dreadnought do? Hey, I don't think any Pokemon deserves that agility. Hey, you lucky you didn't, you're not the one that got blown back. Ooh, yeah, slowing down with the agility. Whoa, teamwork really makes the dream work. Hop can Dynamax now? Oh, it's on a timer. Whoa. Don't need no Dynamax. Hop, don't Dynamax, bro. Don't do it. Don't do it. Bro, hey, hey! I'll reach up there and squat it. <laughs> Bam! No! It's my turn to Dynamax! Fuck out of here, boy. Excuse me.
Bro. I'm so tired of Hop Dog. I, I hope this is the last thing we do with him in this post game. I'm so tired of him. Look at that. Be gone. Be gone. Okay, so I'm gonna predict this next one. I'm gonna leave with Carcoal. No, I, it's gonna be at the fire type gym. I'm gonna leave a uh, Carcoal. Cole also. I can leave uh, Modesto where he is. And that you goes fine. Because of everyone's hip, no one was hurt, and we were able to turn the tide of the situation. I'll keep that Pokemon at Holbury Stadium until it can fully recover. Nappy, if you ever need any help, just let me know. Well, leave a comment. I suppose I'll see you later then. Thank you so much for your help, truly. Okay, so... I don't know if they're gonna make me go to every single gym in the region, but so far, this post-game story is more exciting than the main story. <laughs> like, uh, Chairman Rose and, uh, Olga, or whatever her name was, Swordward and Shieldbert, <laughs> as goofy as they are, I don't know, maybe it's just I, I just finished watching anime. Or I just finished watching an anime. Or no, I just finished watching like two or three anime, so they seem very anime, and whereas, whereas like Team Yell was just like, who are you? Who are you? Shut up, stop yelling. Why are you yelling? Excuse me. Excuse me. I wanna go over there. Take me over there. Uh, yeah, my mods are good. Since I run from the Pokemon Center, yeah, I'm good. I don't have to worry about nothing. I'm good. Excuse me. Excuse me. I flash my champion badge, my champion ID. Excuse me, excuse me. Let me through here. Here, there's a disturbance going on. Champion Nubby and Piers and Hopadu. Mr. Kabu, I'm glad you remember me. Of course I do. You two were red hot after all. I'll never forget seeing you off after you completed your first leg of the gym challenge. Do you think we really don't think we really got time for a friendly gin wag? Right! Actually the situation's getting pretty bad over at the stadium. Yeah, that'd be why we're here. Ah! Brilliant! The opponents are a bit much to take on single-handedly, so I was wondering what to do. But with you all at my side, my confidence in this battle is burning brighter by the minute. Let's begin! As he trots off. Excuse me! Hey, hey, the jagged is up. Oracle! Bro, the enemy is a bit much to take on by yourself. Bro, bro, bro. I don't think anyone's ever looked at Torkoal and thought, oh shit, I need backup. <laughs> oh god damn, I need backup immediately, bro. I don't know about that. I mean, I guess if I was doing like a grass monotype, maybe a... Uh... <laughs> Did I do that? Why are you doing that, bro? You ain't got water kick? Gardenia or somebody. Is there a grass rock Pokemon? Is there a grass rock Pokemon? I feel like there definitely is. Fossils. Mmm. The rock grass. The leaping cray dilly. I just got to him. Oh, that's whack. <laughs> I don't know why. 
Oh, that's whack. Uh, what's going on here? I look away for one second. I have a, a, a separate uh, train of thought. Do I still haven't finished this yet? How many snipe shots I gotta do? Body press? Was slam too aggressive? Body press? Hmm, can't slam. Gotta press. Looks like we were able to extinguish things this time. I'll let this Pokemon rest here at Mortal Stoke Stadium until it gets its energy back. And Nappy, should you have need of my help, please do not hesitate to ask. Don't worry, I know. You all have more work that needs to be done, yes? Go forward, youths. I wish you well. Is Sonya going to come out and say, Oh my god, there's five more gems! B, B, B. Hey, Nappy, is that your Rotom phone ringing? Nappy, we've got trouble. Those two weirdos have showed up at the Pokemon lab. What? Sonya, you all right? They keep rudely demanding a hand over wishing stars. I'm all right for now, but get over here quick, okay? These guys are right creepy. Nobody knew what the fuck that sound was because ain't nobody pick up the Rotom phone. <laughs> Ever since Gen 2, ain't nobody answered the goddamn phone. What are those two doing going after wishing stars? We gotta help Sonya and get back the rusted shield. Let's hurry to the Pokemon lab. Hey, can we exchange Hop for his older brother? Then we'd be a pretty formidable team. He really doesn't think anything through. Sure does make him seem a proper fool. Nah, I guess the word would be reckless. We're headed to the Pokemon lab next, right? Guess I'll stick by you till we see this through. Just admit you're having a good time, Piers, okay? We get it, you're grungy, you're edgy, you got an image to uphold, but you can just say, hey, I'm really enjoying this. I wanna keep hanging out with you guys. Never hurts to have a friend. Never hurts to have a friend, Piers. We got you, buddy. We got you. Bring it in. Bring it in, Piers. Bring it in. Wait, time out. I gotta heal my mons. You can bring it in after that. Bring it around there. Excuse me. Look at that winning squad. A champions team. Mm. Each and every one of them. Each and every one of them. Winners in their own right. Couldn't get a better team. Just couldn't. Couldn't get a better team. Excuse me. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Swordward, Mr. Shielbert. Are you in here? We know all the wishing stars that Chairman Ruse had gathered are here. We celebrities have an enhanced level of insight into such things. You non-celebrities are not suited to having no such valuable things. Hand them over to us. Wishing stars and being a celebrity have nothing to do with each other. I don't know how you know about this, but there's no way we're giving them to you. You just, no, you can just admit that you have them. Why would you even say that? Uh, it's just like a peaceful sit-in until they get the wishing stars. <laughs> we're not leaving. <laughs> How do you only want tea? That's right. You could never understand how important these wishing stars are. You have no need for them. Goodness, whatever should we do, younger brother? It would certainly seem we have been inconvenienced, older brother. <laughs> Sonya and the professor are the ones who've been inconvenienced here, bitch. <laughs> ha! Forcing Pokemon to Dynamax against their will, you've gone way out of bounds here. And I haven't forgot about getting back the rusted shield either. <laughs> well, 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 I certainly thought the champion would come, but I didn't think a loser would follow. Hey, I take back anything I said about his hair. <laughs> uh, must I have you once again taste the flavor of a humiliating defeat? <sighs> Don't let those goons put you down. That's right. <laughs> That's my job. You lost the battle, but don't lose that rockin' spirit. R right. 
Hey, we'll fight them together, bro. Nappy, thanks, mate. First things first, let's get these weirdos out of here. Weirdos? Oh, how they wound me, older brother, to be called so terrible a thing as weirdos by these ruffians. Indeed, to address royals such as ourselves in such a manner cannot, will not be forgiven. This time I brought much stronger Pokemon to thoroughly trounce you with. Hey, I love them. <laughs> oh, it wounds me. Hey, if we have, if I got a team with Hop to have a battle with these two jokers right here, I'm about it. What stronger Pokemon? You brought the same Pokemon. I didn't say a Hop. Did he have this one before? Hey, yo, first impression on the the, the sheep. I'm going to get the bug out. No, ow, yeah, ah, ah, oh. stop. Oh. I could have done it. equal damage. That's only fair. Come on, you guys. This is a video game. It's supposed to be fun. Why are you gonna be like this? <laughs> Why are you gonna be like this? Come on. Damn. Fuck it up. Okay. Hey, you better watch out, bro. Hey, fuck it. Oh! Fuck. Too much fucking it up. Reel back to fucking it up. Hey, this still works. Bam! Oh! It's overdrive. I clicked on it thinking, um, it was discharged. Whoops. Um. That is a psychic type. Just remember that. I'm gonna click overdrive because I don't wanna waste any more turns. If you knock out my. Alphonse, that's fine. I'd rather get damage off instead of swapping again. Hey, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Useless as the blade. Be gone. Be gone. Where's that you go. I'm gonna keep clicking overdrive. Maybe they won't attack me. Why are you double edging steel types? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey! Unbuckle your belt! Let the fuck it up go! Fuck it up! Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up! Oh, wait. I thought he was gonna another Pokemon. I guess. <laughs> that wouldn't be very fair. Bro, whoa, are you attacking me because I'm a threat? You attacking me because I've been fucking it up? Well, I'm not putting my belt back on. I'm gonna continue to fuck it up. I'm just letting you know that. I'm gonna continue. There's a couple Rajas here now. Look at these two goofy asses, dude. Oh, he has a phalanx. Oh, I love that Pokemon. Hey, I'm gonna tell you right now, when we do our fucking shield playthrough, that's on the squad. That's gonna be on the motherfucking squad. Hundo person. 100 percent. Are you ready, 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 ready? Are you ready, 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 ready? Hey, fuck it up. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. Hey, can you handle that phalanx though? Why? Reel in the fuck it up. Come on, bro. I can a high horse power. Shit, this is a fighting type. Fuck. I'm gonna do nothing this turn, then it's gonna close combat me. Uh, yeah! oh, oh, oh! Whoa! Hey, hey, you don't even worry, Dub Wool. I'm talking to you, Dub Wool, not that loser trainer. <laughs> Hey, they attacked you because you were a threat. You did such good work. Hey, fuck that light screen though. Work, 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 work. Um, what are we doing? 
What even is this battle? Because I feel like he's definitely going to... Sound like a, a attack job with Modern Warfare. Bro, I I'm glad I clicked play rough. So I thought to myself, well, what am I gonna do? He's gonna go before me and he's definitely this flying type. He's definitely gonna fuck up this fighting type in front of it. But hey, I want my to go against nature. It wanted to go for the bug. He was dead. And I clicked play rough because I figured whatever well, kill, so I'm gonna do damage too, so. Yeah! Clink clan. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where do you get these robots from, dog? Shieldbert with the robot. Wait, so who did he have? Oh, damn. Because no, the first time we fought Swordward, he had four mines. And this time he only had three. I wonder what his fourth mine is. What did he have? He had a Kling Clang, a Bronze Zone, and Phalanx. Hey, you're gonna take my shine here. Can we get plus one to high horsepower? Priority? Hop, you're a loser. You're a loser, bro. This is like, he walked in and just <sighs> cracked open the pickles. I loosened the jar, bro. I loosened that jar. Okay? That was all me. My nose really itches right here. <laughs> I've been trying to, like, casually scratch it throughout this entire recording. But I just really don't give a fuck anymore. Like, my fucking nose itches, and I'm gonna scratch the shit out my goddamn nose right here, right now. <laughs> It's so annoying, like, I could sit and stare at the wall for a billion years and never have any issues, and the moment I click record, everything itches, everything's a problem, all the dogs are barking, everything goes wrong. <laughs> Ugh! Quite the vexing predicament indeed, older brother. Oh, surely this must be some kind of mistake, wouldn't you say, younger brother? I did it! We won! We really won! That exquisite Pokemon we trained actually lost! Hm. You only won because you two teamed up. Still, we offer you ruffians our praise. Oh, are the two of you teamed up too? Give back the rusted shield and stop forcing Pokemon to go all crazy. Ah, uh, sorry. Is this a bad time? My apologies for the intrusion. Those men are dangerous! Be careful! Well done. Your infiltration mission was a resounding success, it seems. Have you gathered the wishing stars? Yes, thanks to Master Swordward and Shieldbert buying me so much time. Ooh. Ooh, the assistant. They didn't even give her a name. I should have known! Give back those wishing stars. Oh dear, it would seem we've been completely had. Yeah, it's a rough first day on the job, Sophia. Or Sonia. <laughs> Why, this moment is so sweet. I don't think I'll need any sugar in my tea later. Our battle with you was just a little trick. We'd won before you grabbed a single Pokeball. And with that, farewell. Stop! Why? What was the reason? Professor Sonia, I'm sorry. Was everything, was it all a lie right from the start? There was no helping it. It was necessary for the plan. Our plan to put Galar under the control of the royal lineage once again. Excuse me. Seems that Glot did have something to back up all their big talk. 
So those two weren't working alone? Well, you knew her for what? 36 hours? <laughs> okay, y'all stay here and cry. I guess I'm gonna go do the shit. Wait, don't just leave without saying anything. <laughs> but you were upset. We didn't want to make it, want to say anything to make it worse. We were trying to be considerate, but of course I'd be down on myself. It was my fault. I got tricked by a nicket in Wooloo's clothing. But that's it. No more feeling sorry for myself. That lay, blah, 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 that lot made off like bandits with all the wishing stars. It'd be awful if they use if they were used for some evil purpose, so there's no time to be feeling down. Ah! <laughs> You've got some guts. You've certainly grown strong in the face of adversity, dearie. Grant. Dynamaxing draws out the true strength from the trust between a Pokemon and their trainer. But that group is likely pouring the Gala particles emitted by the wishing stars into Pokemon, forcing them to Dynamax. Well, that's pretty awful. Indeed, what a novel thing to do to Pokemon. The theft of the wishing stars was just the start. Things would get a lot worse from here on. But why? What was wait, what was the reason? What reason could they have for forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? Those weirdos said that they wanted to reveal the true natures of Zacian and Zamazenta. I'm curious about what my former assistant said about a royal lineage. Did she mean it? Literally? Ah, Nabby, look at your town map! I'm detecting huge reactions at four stadiums now. <laughs> they certainly get around, don't they? If there is trouble at the stadiums, then Marnie could be in a real bad way. Ah, uh, Spikeman seems to be okay. There's no power spot stadium there. <clears throat> right -o. Nappy, there's no time to be lying about. If Pokemon are in trouble, why are we still here? Let's get right out there to lend a hand. I'm sorry to leave it all to you, but you'll have to take care of the Dynamax Pokemon. I'll search for those sword and shield weirdos in the meantime. So, it's every gym. We have to go to every gym. We have four more battles to do. Ooh. Ooh. And look at little Spike Miss. No, no power spots. <laughs> okay, well. I had to take a little girl to her first vet appointment, and this seems like a perfect time to wrap up anyways. Uh, I know on this series I don't do intros on every single episode, but it won't be the last time we do a Sword and Shield LP. When we do a uh, Shield, it'll be much more formal, but this one, I just I just wanted a game. I just wanted to play a video game, so that's it. So, thank you guys so much for your support. Thank you for your love and your loyalty. I'm glad you guys are hyped and excited for Collection 1. Um, a lot of work went into this, so thank you guys so much for the support. Uh, well, I'll catch you guys next time for some more post-game Sword and Shield. Until then, I'm out this bitch. Bye!